I'm Amay Lutkin, and this is Very Real Talk. And here are some of the people you have definitely fooled yourself into liking. Being deeply, meaningfully, truly in love is rare and wonderful. Some of us are still looking for it. Some of us who are in this room talking to the camera. Meanwhile, we have a lot of time to kill, and you'll probably find yourself crushing on the wrong person. Here are a few of the usual suspects you'll trip over on the road to love. One, the person who doesn't answer texts. Hey, wanna get a drink tonight? Stop. Ha ha ha. That was for someone else. I'm trapped under something heavy. Come help me. Bring wine. It's tempting to explain away someone's total lack of interest in you with the idea that they're in a movie or an underground corn maze. But one day you'll look back and realize you were crushing on someone who's just a total waste of time. Two, the person who flirts with you when their girlfriend is out of the room. Okay, this is something that you'll probably fall for as a teen or a very immature person in your 20s. A hint of the forbidden. You'll be crushing on someone who is taken. Memorize this little speech. If you're looking for a side piece, I can tell you. I don't have the time for that. I'm Liam Neeson. What I do have is a very particular set of skills. Skills I've acquired over a very long career. Skills that make me a nightmare for people like you. It's called a bullshit detector. I'm not here to boost anyone's ego, get strung along, or break up a happy home. Especially if you won't even answer my text. <laughs> Three, the person who was literally the only cutie in the office. And we all wanted a piece of this person, even if they wore socks with sandals or microwave fish in the employee lounge. They almost look like Zac Efron if you squinted and were a few beers deep at happy hour and it was dark. Close quarters, cross crush borders. You have to put that on a pillow. Four, the person you changed yourself for. Yeah, we've all done it. Someone hot crosses your path and they're really into death metal and Justin Bieber is your ringtone. We all at some point will twist ourselves into a pretzel to be right for the wrong person. Don't do it. They'll be in the room someday when your phone goes off. Like if grandma calls, I don't know who else uses a phone. Sorry is playing. And you'll be really sorry. Five, your priest. You know what I'm talking about. It's hard to protect yourself from all the Mr. and Mrs. wrongs out there. Just be true to yourself and consider a practice for the real thing and never tell them about that priest thing. 